When I began my journey using Blender 3D, I quickly realized that creating realistic and dynamic characters was one of the most challenging aspects of the process. However, with time and further research, I discovered five solid ways to add characters to my Blender scene. Of course, I will not delve into the actual process of creating characters from scratch as it's outside of my area of expertise. It's also something I'm not willing to do as it's quite time consuming. Instead, I will provide you ways you can quickly add a character and save time in the process. Quick disclaimer, none of these tools that I mention are sponsored. I just have personally dabbled with them and wanted to share them with you. There are both free and paid options for these tools. And as the saying goes, you get what you pay for. So let's get into it. das 3 d has been my go-to tool for creating adjustable characters. It has an array of tools and features for artists to create stunning 3D models and animation. But there is one downside. The cost can add up when purchasing additional clothing and different characters. Character Creator. Real Illusions Character Creator software is a powerful tool that enables user to create fully customizable characters for to use in different various applications such as video games, films, or animations. The software provides a range of features and tools including a vast library of pre-made assets such as clothing, hairstyles, and accessories, as well as the ability to customize facial features, body, proportions, and more. And again here, the only downside is that it can get pricey if you want full access to everything. But the bright side is you can also try their free trial to see if it works for you. Human Generator. This is a Blender add-on that I used for a few of my artworks in the past and my experience with it is, I would say, neutral. It does a really good job when it comes to close-up details, hair, hands, but falls short when it comes to clothing and poses. In those areas, it could do a better job. However, the prices are not crazy as some of the other options out there. Speaking of crazy prices, have you heard of my affordable character PNG pack? Apologies for the shameless plug there. But I generally created this pack because I needed it myself. What you see on the screen are some of my most engaging artworks using these PNG packs. While I acknowledge that these characters are not three dimensional and there are limitation, they can still add a lot of personality to your scenes without overloading your computer. I also love the fact that these PNGs create cast shadows when there is light or reflection. So if you're interested in getting some silhouette characters and human shapes, this PNG pack is a great option. And since you're watching this video as a token of my appreciation for your support, I'm offering an exclusive 25% just for you. All you have to do is just click the link below and the discount will be applied. Another way to add characters to your scene is through 3D assets platforms like Sketchfab and CG Trader. These platforms offer both free and paid characters that you can use in your scenes. However, keep in mind using free characters may result in your work losing its uniqueness as others may also use the same character. But let's say if you want to go the extra mile and you want to create your own unique characters, there is a bonus tip for you and that is you can use scanning apps. Scanning apps like Polycam to scan yourself or your friends. Keep in mind that they are not perfect and definitely not recommended for close-ups. So. <laughs> Bear that in mind. However, they can be really useful and used in so many ways. I made a full YouTube video about 3D scanning. If you are interested, you can check it out. The link will be in the description. That's all for today. Make sure to like and subscribe that <laughs> like and subscribe. That would help a lot. And if you're interested to learn more about my creative workflow, feel free to check out my Blender Masterclass and I will see you guys in the next one.